to do some delicious scones. Now, what I've got is, I need to tell you, what I've got is, is some strong flour in a bowl. And yeah. I'm just putting, so I'm just putting some butter. And you put it in with also some sugar, okay? And I'm making it look like breadcrumbs. Yes, now, you just crumble uh, it with your fingers. Yes. Crumble it with But as it happens, I've got one ready. <laughs> oh, magic. <laughs> <Ta -da. Woo>! Now, <laughs> baking soda's gone in. Okay. Uh -huh. Right. Now, I've got some buttermilk, okay? So the only thing to do this is with your hands. Make a hole, put it all in. Now, obviously, well, yeah. dare I say, dare I say, Rachel, I've used some Canadian flour here, which is strong flour, but it absorbs. Now, if you get strong flour that absorbs a lot, have a little extra milk at the ready, which I've got. Right, right, right. Just, in case it gets, in case the dough gets too tight. It's a bit too dry, yep. yeah. Yep. So just get it, put it in. Actually, this make me all right, actually. That's it right. looks pretty good. Right. I think that looks great, actually. Just a little bit. Rosemary, yeah, it's Rosemary, you, you, you had a birthday recently. Yes, congratulations. Yeah, now, look, you... Rachel, I did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, now, look, I have to tell you, you're only as young as you feel. That's true. You're, I mean, for me, I have had a birthday, and it is a big birthday. And luckily, depends how quick you are. <laughs> are you going to be quick? I was 70. I can't 70. believe that because you look literally half <laughs> that age. You look half Fantastic. that age. And you have the energy of a woman less than half your age. And I think that's <laughs> remarkable. Oh, you're so lovely. Now, yo, I need you around the corner. I need you to be near me. Right, <laughs> so what I've done is, I've now cut, I've now just rolled out the dough. Now this dough, this will make about 16, 12 to 16, depends how big you want them. Now, I do, wait for it, Rachel. Wait for it. I do square scones. Yes. Now you need a hot, you need a hot tray to put them on. Yes. Hang on, hang on. You need a hot tray. Look, hot tray. Hot now, tray. What you, hot tray. Now what you do is cut, cut, okay, cut. I'm going to do them big then. Turn them upside down. Oh, no, yes. flour. Yes. Flour. Yes. Turn them upside down. Okay, upside down. The reason for turning them upside down is because they rise better, okay? Oh, wow. That's a fabulous tip. I love that. Yeah, but these are far too big, Rachel. These are far too big. Far <laughs> too big. Just put flour on the top. Ready? And put them in the oven. Wait. Ooh. Delightful. Egg I will wait no, forever for you, them. my darling. I'll wait no. forever for you. <laughs> okay. Now, hang on. Wait for me. Wait for me. I am. I am until the end of time. Here. Here. Woo! <laughs> now, wait a minute. I made this jam. Isn't this adorable? This is it's a strawberry beautiful. pot. Look at this it's pot. It's gorgeous. It's a little, Look at that. It's a strawberry. It's a strawberry it's shape. Gorgeous. And it's gorgeous. And it, I made this last year, actually. Two, oh, 2020. And it's some Cornish cream. Beautiful. Look at this. Oopsie. <laughs> if you were in heaven, this is what you would do. You would put, you would put the cream first, if you were in Devon. Okay, like that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Like that. And then you put the jam like that. Up if on you're top. In, no, if you're in Cornwall, you put the jam first. Ah. Oh. And then you put the cream on top. Now, which is the best? 